Hagna, a town that many know for its port that connects to Kamigen and Cagayan de Oro in Mindanao, and it's also a place to stop for food when you're on your way to Anda. But with 33 barangays stretching from the ocean into the mountains, there's so much to explore in Hagna. In the past, I've gone snorkeling at Hagna Rock, learned how to make kalamai, and slept overnight in Mayana to hike Bahal's highest peak. Today, I want to show you more of what Hagna has to offer and show you why you should add it to your places to visit in Bahal. You can bring your motorbike there, just slowly. Yeah? Okay. Improvements. So we will make a parking. Then yeah, that's good. The road will be yeah. It's a fun road. All right, so we made it to the Kinahugan Falls. This is Chris. Hey. <laughs> Welcome. Chris is a local guide here in Bohol, and he actually lives here in Hagna. So he uh, offered to take me around, show me some places that not a lot of tourists get to go to. So. We're going to go check out a few things that you should definitely add to your bucket list when you come to Bahal. Welcome to the Kinahugan Falls. Quick change of plans. Chris actually lives really close to here and he just said, hey, why don't I just go home and grab some food and we can just have lunch here. So he's off to do that. I'm on my way back to the bike. I forgot one of my cameras, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna grab the stuff on my bike and then let's go for a swim. Oh, it's so cold. <laughs> It's so cold. I can't get myself to go here. <laughs> I was really hot before I got here and I was like, oh, I'm really looking forward to a nice cold swim. But this is so cold. Okay, let's do this. All right, I tried to find a quiet enough spot that I, hopefully you can hear me. Um, just went for a little swim. It's so freezing cold. I really wanted to go for a swim to cool off because it's been so hot, but this is freezing cold water. But it's really refreshing. I am going to get back in, but uh, I'm just going to keep swimming for a little bit. Chris is on his way with the food and then we're going to eat. It is refreshing. This is such a cool spot. You're right in the jungle, got the waterfalls coming down. Doesn't seem to be anybody here. It's a Saturday. I imagine more people will be here on a Sunday. Really cool spot to check out. It's really not that far from Tagbilaran, but uh, you could definitely come to this spot if you're on your way to Anda, or if you just want to come to Hagna and explore a lot of different things. Um, we're going to be doing the waterfall. There's some hiking. Mayana is at the top of the mountain that's where they have the strawberry farm and you can do some camping there they also have more hiking but uh, yeah a lot of stuff to do here in Hagna all right Chris is back with the food let's go see what he got dude it's so cold yeah very hot outside <laughs> hello that's my uh Cousins, son. Hi. 
Apple, he had a great lunch. Chris went for his swim, and now we're gonna get a coconut, but look how high this is. Way too high. I should get out of the way. Thank you. Yeah. Fresh from that tree. Well, we're done at the waterfall. We had our lunch here, had a really great time. We had the place to ourselves pretty much most of the day. Uh, some people just started coming now, now that the sun's going down. But for us, we're gonna go for a little hike. He tells me that there's a really great viewpoint. I really wanna see it. We're gonna fly the drone. We're headed back up the hill. This, I think, is gonna be the fun part. Makes the road from my last video look like nothing. So currently there isn't any uh, entrance fee, but they are working on building it up and maintaining it. So donations are always appreciated. Yeah. No. Should probably go to the top. Okay, the top. Yeah. yeah. Even if I have to take a few breaks. Yeah. Well, we're starting to get a view. Oh, I can see a view coming. Check this out. at the top. Yeah. Quick break. It's very steep. We made it. All right, thank you, Chris. Thank you. Thanks yeah, for bringing us up here. What an amazing view. We have the view uh, all the way up to towards Anda. We have Hagna down on this side. Really great place. Nice little hike. It really didn't take that long. Maybe 10 minutes, yeah. 15, because I needed to stop a few times. But yeah, it's on the way. Uh, if you're in Hagna, if you're going towards Moyana, it's just up that way. Um, you probably need a guide. There's no real signs at the entrance, so you might want to give him a call. I'm going to put his uh, Facebook page in the description below if you want to give him a call for just tours around Hagna or even tours around Bahal. He'll be able to help you out. I think I'm gonna call it a quits here. We're gonna head back down to the mountain and then I'm gonna go home. So have a great day. See you later, bye.